Hello and welcome beloved sons of God from all over the nations watching this. We have a wonderful message today that will bless you greatly by our dear man of God, Pastor Chris. And it is titled, Make Impact with Your Giving. Praise the Lord. Our opening verse is read from Matthew chapter 13 verse 44. And it says, Again, the kingdom of heaven is like unto treasure hid in a field, the which when a man had found, he hideth and for." Joy thereof goeth and selleth all that he hath, and buyeth that field. In the kingdom of God's dear Son, where you now live, all your resources, including your home, finances, and your physical body, are all kingdom property. 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verses 19 to 20 makes it clear. It says, What? Know you not that your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost which is in you, which ye have of God, and ye are not your own? For ye are bought with a price. You are the temple of God, and the temple sanctifies all things that are brought into it. Everything that is brought to the temple is different from the things outside the temple. When money comes to you, for example, it becomes kingdom money, one sanctified for the master's use and glory. Hallelujah! Until you recognize this, your money will not be different from the money of the sinners, and what happens to their money will happen to yours. 2 Corinthians chapter 9 verse 8 in the Amplified Classic translation declares, And God is able to make all grace, every favor and earthly blessing come to you in abundance, so that you may always and under all circumstances and whatever the need be self-sufficient, possessing enough to require no aid or support, and furnished in abundance for every good work and charitable donation. In this kingdom, your greatness never diminishes. Glory to God, for He brought you into a life of ever-increasing glory, ever-increasing faith, and ever-increasing grace. Hallelujah! 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 10 says, Now he that ministered seed to the sower, both minister bread for your food, and multiply your seed sown, and increase the fruits of your righteousness. Make impact for the kingdom through your giving and watch your life blossom in righteousness. Hallelujah! That was powerful and I trust that it has stirred you to do more for the expansion of God's kingdom on the earth. Right now, I would like to invite you to proclaim this confession together with me. What an honor to be a financer of the gospel. I invest wisely and rightly as I give for the expansion of God's kingdom and spread of His righteousness all over the world. Through my giving, my righteousness is established and God channels blessings to me from everywhere. Hallelujah! As always, you may note down these series of scriptures that you can study further all from the epistle of 2 Corinthians in chapter 8 verses 9 to 10 in the Amplified Classic Translation and chapter 9 verses 7 to 10 also in the Amplified Classic Translation. Blessed be God! How can you have a blue day when you are listening to teachings like these? They just make you want to jump because these are your present hour reality. Subscribe to these podcasts as we bring you daily refreshments of God's word through the Rhapsody of Realities by a man of God. Click on the share button to ensure that your family, friends, colleagues can partake in this glorious truth. Like our videos to let others know that this was worth hearing and comment down below to let us know it has made tremendous impact in your life. Glory to God! Continue to lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven in your giving and we will see you again tomorrow. We trust you have been blessed by this devotional. We invite you to make Jesus Christ the Lord of your life by praying thus. O Lord God, I believe 
with all my heart in Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. I believe He died for me and God raised Him from the dead. I believe He is alive today. I confess with my mouth that Jesus Christ is the Lord of my life from this day. Through Him and in His name, I have eternal life. I am born again. Thank you, Lord, for saving my soul. I am now a child of God. Hallelujah. Congratulations. You are now a child of God. To receive more information on how you can grow as a Christian, please get in touch with us by emailing us at tni.msia at gmail.com. That's tni.msia at gmail.com. We look forward to hearing your testimony. You are blessed.